Hotter than fire between false friends does friendship five days burn. When the sixth day comes, the fire cools, and ended is all the love. Hey everybody, it's Jeremy. Welcome back to turn 51 of Ares, where we are playing Utgard. Uh, let's jump into the turn. So, not a whole lot this turn, um, except for a battle in the Mighty Pillars. We do have a message from Gath, actually, so. But this isn't just specifically to us. About a stealthy elf, the darkness seeps, the holding reached, unrest ever increasing, our thirst for blood only salvation to reach their holdings too. So, a Gath is basically just a really at war with Midgard. <laughs> All right, so we've got a battle in the Mighty Pillars. Let's go ahead and watch this. We've got a big old line of everything. And... We got a very small amount of province defense. So... All right, that's fine. No big deal. Let's watch how this goes. So we do our uh, initial casting of... Body Ethereal. And we get almost none of our actual mages, which is a little unfortunate. Um, but then the spam begins. Oh my goodness, it cleaves. Almost immediately routes, basically. Oh, oh, I love it. It's so good. They don't really move forward very much, but I guess they still have targets in range. And then they basically stop casting. Yeah, I don't know, whatever. Okay, so, uh, very cool. Um, we lost one Huskarl, 11 Long Dead, 7 Long Dead Giants. Um, kind of a lot, honestly, for the PD, but watching the Seath Kona's work was pretty cool. What else do we got? We've got uh, Unexpected Dominion, or Unexpected Event in Troll Woods. At this point, I don't think it's unexpected. I think it's pretty expected. Um, the Troll Woods continuously is going to be a thorn in our side as... Oh, a different one, sorry. Um, a market was held in the province. Merchants from far and wide gathered, and there was much commerce. 590 gold. This is super nice for us. Thank you very much. Um, we have foreseen a Stars are Right for Evocations, and the entrance to the fortification in Mighty Pillars has been breached. Okay, so, that means that we can storm the fort in Mighty Pillars, and we indeed are going to be storming the fort in Mighty Pillars. Um, we've swipped, swapped, swip, swap, swipity swap, swapped up our, ooh, our stuff just a tad, um... Not really much at all, but we're basically just doing the exact same thing as what we already did. We're going to hope that... Uh, you know what? I'm really... I'm really considering... I'm really considering putting a couple of... Uh, Seaths into the mix as slaves. Like... I know... I know... I know two Scrotty can support ten. I'm less... I'm less convinced about, like, fifteen. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve in the communion. That is probably okay. I did end up pulling a couple more from previously, um... Well, this is probably fine. This is this is absolutely probably fine. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna go with it. We're gonna go with it, and we're gonna storm the castle, and that's pretty much it. So we are researching in Ulm. We're up to fifty three seats now. Um, we're continuing our research. Gonna knock out Blood Magic three, and then we're gonna start heading up Alteration because that gets us things like next turn it gets a Wooden Warriors, which is really nice, right? And Vulnerability can be really nice for us. It gets us things like Battle Fortune, which actually is pretty decent, because that's luck, basically, on all of... No, it's not even on all. What's the one that's all? Is it Will of the Fates? Yeah, Will of the Fates is luck. Luck all. Huh. 
So Battle Fortune's just luck large, basically. <laughs> um, but still nice, right? It's still something nice that we can spam out. Um, uh, Doom is the thing that I was thinking of. That's really nice. It's it's basically curse all. Um, but we really want to get up to mass protection. That's kind of the next big nice thing that we could get to. Um, so we may, we may make it there. We probably won't. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Um, in the meantime, we're going to hopefully beat Ulm here. We might not. Um, Ulm might turn around and just crush us. So we will see how it goes. Um, but hopefully we'll be good. And in Ulm, we are actually recruiting a uh, Jotun Goad and a just regular Goad because we need some preachers. <laughs> they <laughs> prob probably... Um, shortly, if we do win in Mighty Pillars, we're almost immediately going to be taking Behemoth's Rest, trying to ford it, and trying to get some temples up. We do have a minor, minor, minor amount of income, right? Um, and we're actually recruiting just... Actually, you know what? I'm not even going to do that. I'm going to cancel those. Because we're going to have... We're going to use this gold for if we, if we win, we're immediately going to temple... And we're going to try to get over to Behemoth's Rest, immediately try to take that, ford it, temple it, etc. So that we can get out of the chance of having uh, our run ended by a dom kill. <laughs> that would really suck for the end of this all to just be a dom kill run. Uh, oh, he found a ruins of the old empire. Very nice. Lucky him. Cool. Um, okay. Uh, we are... Also, we can see, right, uh, Gath has these Fire Lords that he has out raiding. I also, I want to get some more scouts going. Some more scouts going. What's the chance there? What's the chance? You know what? Here, we'll we'll ditch a goad and we'll we'll go for the big one. We'll get a, some more scouts. So I need to reestablish our ability to scout, basically. Um, okay, so that's pretty much the turn. It's a very quick turn. Uh, I apologize. But uh, we did all the long stuff last time when we were scripting and showing off everything. And now it's basically just make or break. Hopefully hopefully it works. If, if it doesn't... Oops. <laughs> uh, oops. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I will see you all next time. Peace.